Thank you for your interest in CyberLock, an access control system based on electronic lock cylinders, programmable keys, and flexible management software. This presentation gives an overview of CyberLock hardware and software. What are the most important features of CyberLock hardware? CyberLock technology has been incorporated into over 150 lock designs. These electronic cylinders are the exact dimensions of the mechanical cylinders they are replacing. No wiring is needed. Power is provided by the battery in the key. Cyber locks cannot be picked and cyber keys cannot be duplicated. One key can be used for an entire system. Outside entryways, inside doors, cabinets, and padlocks on containers. The CyberLock system is comprised of different hardware components. However, the hardware basics included in every system are CyberLocks and CyberKeys. In addition, programming devices are used to program and download locks. Installation is as easy as removing the existing mechanical cylinder and replacing it with the CyberLock cylinder. CyberLock cylinders can be installed in many different types of door hardware, such as knob, lever, mortise, rim, and profile locks. The uniqueness of the CyberLock system is the ability to provide access control beyond just entry doors, including cabinets, cash machines, drawers, elevators, machinery, padlocks, ticket machines, and vending machines. No other electronic lock can do this. There are several hardware security features in each CyberLock. In contrast to most mechanical locks, the CyberLock cylinders have a unique physical design that prevents the use of standard lock picking tools. This, combined with the encrypted access codes within the cylinder, makes the CyberLock pick proof. Each cylinder has a torque break. If torque is applied to the front of the cylinder, the front part of the cylinder separates from the back half. The back half of the cylinder expands, causing a brake effect that engages the sides of the cylinder's case, stopping the rotation and leaving the cylinder in the locked position. The circuit board inside the cylinder is surrounded by silicone material, which provides protection from environmental hazards like salt air, dust, and water. This allows installation in both indoor and outdoor applications. CyberLock cylinders have been tested for electrical current using a stun gun rated at 300,000 volts and with magnets rated in excess of 18,000 gauss. The cylinders remain in a locked position and continue to perform normally. The CyberLock cylinder has a circuit board with microprocessor and memory. Four types of intelligence are stored in the cylinder. Encrypted access codes that ensure that only keys within the system work with the lock the unique ID number of the lock cylinder, a record of the last 1,100 entries, and lost key IDs to eliminate access by any key that is missing or lost. Cyber keys contain four levels of intelligence. Encrypted access codes to ensure the key is from the same installation as the lock. The unique ID number of the key. Access schedules for the user of the key and storage of up to 3,900 events, both authorized and denied. Also contained in the key is the battery and a clock chip that is used to keep time. The battery inside the key is a standard lithium 3-volt battery and can easily be replaced in the field. When the key comes in contact with the cylinder, it provides power to the circuitry in the lock so that the key and the lock can communicate. A single battery will provide between 1,500 and 5,000 openings with a maximum life of one year. The life is directly affected by the software settings and the condition of the battery. Here's what the key does when it contacts the cylinder. First, the key supplies power to the cylinder and communications are established. Then, in a fraction of a second, a sequence of events occurs to determine if the key can open the lock. The cylinder and the key exchange ID numbers. The key verifies that it has access to that lock ID and that the key is there during its scheduled access times. Finally, the key sends its access code to the lock. Now, let's take a look at what's happening inside the lock. At the same time, the lock checks the key ID against its list of lost keys. If the key ID is in the list, the lock denies entry and the key alarms. 
A denied event is written in the memory of the lock and key, and the key is disabled. If the key ID is not on the list of lost keys, and the lock and key access codes match, the lock grants access. There are three additional features that provide an even higher level of security. Cyber keys, unlike mechanical keys, can be set to expire regularly, even on a daily basis. Cyber locks can be programmed for either multiple key custody or delayed access. Multiple key custody is used when you would like two, three, or four keys presented to a lock before a lock will grant access. Delayed access is used in customer applications that require a delay of a few seconds or up to 20 minutes between the time the key is first presented and the lock is able to be opened. Cyber keys and programmers communicate with the Cyber Key base station connects directly to the serial port of the host computer. The Cyber Key authorizers are ideal for remote locations. They allow users to conveniently renew their expired keys on a daily basis for a high degree of key control. CyberAudit 2.0 software is a Windows program that installs on a designated local PC. It is ideal for installations of up to 500 locks and keys. Highlights of CyberAudit 2.0 include ease of setting a schedule, display of audit information, email notification of specific events, automatic management of key expirations, and report generation. With CyberAudit 2.0, programming of the user keys can be done either at the computer, using the base station, or from fixed remote locations, using the remote authorizer. The Videx warranty on your CyberLock products is designed to protect your investment over a period of time. All CyberLock hardware is covered by a one-year warranty, during which we will repair or replace the product at no cost. After that time, there is a graduated replacement fee. If you pay a replacement fee, the product shipped out to you is covered by a new one-year warranty. All this, plus a customer service staff readily available by phone to help you. For further information, please contact your certified CyberLock reseller or the Videx Sales Department. 